Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about one of the fanciest cars from 1956. You had to go to the bank and get approval to have this car become part of your stable at home. It was a very, very special car. We'll tell you more in a minute. Well, greetings from the sales floor of Ellingson Motor Cars here in Rogers, Minnesota. Today we're going to talk about what they call the Continental Mark II, a car that uh, was made by Ford, which was their top of the line for the Lincoln division. It is absolutely breathtaking, as it must have been when it was new in 1956 as well. This is a very, very custom car, even in its day when it was built. It was just, everything about it was very, very special. With the long hood, with the uh, hood emblem still in the middle of the hood, uh, the uh, great chrome grill work or whatever on this car, and it is all outstanding. This is really high quality chrome, show chrome if you will, uh, done to the best degree possible. Uh, beautiful, uh, Paint on this car all the way done, base coat, clear coat. You can see it's really nice and straight and really, really well done because these are hard cars to get straight because that's a big quarter panel to work on, but it, uh, someone had really took their time with this particular car. Interesting note, these are very special, unique hubcaps just for the 56 Mark IIs. Beautiful interior with the two-tone, with the white and the red inserts and whatever. Uh, beautiful carpet that goes with it. This car was loaded, and here's one of the biggest options. Most of these cars came with every option. There was one very expensive option that made this car, believe it or not, 1956, over $10,000 for this car. It was factory air conditioning. And this particular car does have factory air, which is really, really nice, because this would be a nice road car. If you were looking for something that you wanted to take on tour, go on a nice road trip, it's an extremely comfortable car to ride in and drive around. Again, they have the spare continent look trunk, I mean, which is still reminiscent of 1956, of course. Uh, we see that many years later in the Cadillacs, way into the 80s and 90s or whatever, in the Lincoln. So kind of a neat thing, but it was an idea that they had in 1956. So again, beautiful chrome. It's got the wide white, white wall tires, which of course uh, just sets the car off because it just accents the chrome hubcaps with whatnot uh, within the center. Uh, again, uh, an interesting note, it says, Continental across the back has the little uh, emblem of the little knight right there on the back tail light or the, the center of the trunk emblem. It's just really neat. The exhaust does go through. The exhaust comes out of the bumper. Uh, one of those things that they, they experimented with back in those days. It is an outstanding example of a Mark II. And if you're looking for one of those, you can find it here at Ellingson Motor Cars. Uh, we are in Rogers, Minnesota. We're open 10 to 5, Monday through Saturday. Love to have you come in, take a look. Uh, you can also find us on YouTube, uh, Facebook, and Instagram. Make us a favorite. There's lots of stories, lots of videos and things of what we've done over the years, including, of course, this one will be on there shortly. So if you're looking for something unique and special, you really want to be a 1956, it was a special person who owned it, well, guess what? In the year 2020, you would also be a very special person to own it. So thanks for looking today, and uh, hope to see you soon.